Hello, my name is Adam Bean, and today I would like to cover dynamic imports with ES6 modules. So first, I will have to activate a module, the module system, and this works with module. Then I can add, let's say, um, lazy content JS, and uh, I would like to import the lazy content. And this uh, lazy content comprises a default export lazy content class. Let's call it lazy class uh, with a method uh, uh, or function uh, message and oh, message and return uh, lazy today default class lazy class. Then uh, what I also like to do is to have a straight message. Let's call it message. Uh, good morning. And a message method or function, which um, which returns return hello world. So now, to make it usable, I will have to export everything. So I'm going to export uh, the message and the message. Both, and this is already exported because it's a default export. So now, how to use that? And I will just open this here. So what I can do is, uh, and I actually would like to do this with async and await. So import, I'll just call it lazy. So. And I would like to build an async function with no parameters. And now I can do the following. I can say await import. And what I would like to import is lazy content. So this works like that. Lazy content JS. And what I get back are is the module. So uh, or the actual content. So I have that. And now what I can do, I can, for instance, go here and say, I would like, let's take a look, message and message. So message is the, so what you can do right away, I can say this is the const, and this is module dot uh, message, right? No, <laughs> msg, msg. Then, is the um, function and I will just call the function message and then I can use or the module itself which is the default export so this is the default export and how to do this module dot default this is my default content and I can say new because I'm actually saying new to the class and say const lazy class and then I should be able to call the method message of the class. Console log and now call it class. So then console log, console log, um, or not log, just call lazy. And seems to work. So uh, lazy loading, particularly useful if you, uh, for for instance, micro frontends, where you would like to uh, lazily load parts of the system, or if you are building routers. Thank you for watching. See you at ehex.com, uh, Web Standards Workshop with Munich Airport, conferences, ehex TV or ehex FM. So thank you and bye.